Jesus deepens his discourse on prayer, emphasizing a new relationship between the disciples and the Father. He assures them that whatever they ask the Father in his name, he will give them. This statement underscores the shift from the Old Covenant to the New, where believers are encouraged to approach God directly, with Jesus as the mediator. The passage highlights the intimacy and confidence believers can have in their relationship with God, assured that their prayers, aligned with Jesus' name and character, hold power. Jesus clarifies that, until now, they have not asked for anything in his name, indicating a new phase in their spiritual journey post-resurrection. He encourages them to ask so that their joy may be complete, pointing towards a life of fulfilled desires in accordance with God's will. Furthermore, Jesus speaks about his direct origin from the Father in his impending return to the Father, emphasizing his divine authority in the truth of his teachings. It's evident that prayer is not just a ritualistic request but a dynamic interaction rooted in a relationship with God through Jesus. It teaches us the importance of praying with intention, in alignment with the character and will of Jesus, ensuring our prayers are more than words but expressions of faith and trust in God's plan. The passage invites us to reflect on the depth of our prayer life and our understanding of Jesus' role as the mediator between us and God. It challenges us to consider how our prayers reflect our relationship with God and how we can deepen that relationship by trusting more fully in Jesus' intercession for us. How does understanding Jesus as our mediator change the way we approach God in prayer? Heavenly Father, in the quiet moments of our days and the stillness of our nights, we reach out to you, seeking a connection that transcends words. Your Son taught us the profound truth of coming to you in his name, a privilege we embrace with humility and gratitude. We are reminded that in asking, we acknowledge your sovereignty, and in receiving, we experience your generosity. Guide us to understand the depth of our relationship with you, made possible through Jesus. Teach us to approach you with confidence, not because of our merits, but because of the love you have for us, demonstrated through your Son. May our prayers reflect a heart aligned with your will, seeking not only answers but also closeness with you. Help us to cherish the joy that comes from a prayerful life, one that is full of faith and trust in your plan. Open our hearts to the needs of others, prompting us to pray not just for ourselves but for the world you love. In doing so, may we become conduits of your love, peace, and healing. Remind us that our requests, when made in the name of Jesus, carry the weight of divine intention. Let this assurance fill us with peace, knowing that our desires, when in harmony with your will, lead to the fulfillment that only you can provide. In this sacred conversation, we seek not just answers, but transformation, to be more like Jesus and reflect your love and grace in all we do. For it is in giving of ourselves, in service and in prayer, that we find the truest joy. Amen.